Hi, it's Rebecca, and I'm here to read you a little bit of my new book, The Secret Key to the Emerald Tablets of Toad the Atlantean with his divine counterpart. Now, last year I wrote this book, which is about the Emerald Tablets. It is the Emerald Tablets in chapter and verse. This year, there, that's better. This is a channel text which takes Emerald Tablet 3 and both Toth channeled messages through and Seashat, who is his divine counterpart. So stay to the end because I'm going to present a healing technique they asked me to do for you. So Here's a little bit from chapter one, and this is by me, Rebecca Marina Messenger. And this is dedicated to the divine feminine principle. May her grace be revealed and her love save us. Let there be balance at last between the divine female principle and the divine male principle. So, this is expounding on Emerald Tablet 3. We're going to begin with the first verse of Emerald Tablet 3. Toth gives his wisdom. In the original translation from the Atlantean language, Toth said, I, Toth the Atlantean, give of my wisdom, give of my knowledge, give of my power. Freely I give to the children of men, give that they too might have wisdom to shine through the world from the veil of the night. Wisdom is power and power is wisdom. One with each other perfecting the whole. Now that was the original translation Toth says, and he calls it plain English, wisdom and power must go together for power without wisdom is a destructive force. I am ready to teach anyone who will be still and listen. All that is needed is already there on the walls of your heart. It is in the stillness that knowledge is revealed. It is when one realizes that one is already divine that true power begins to emerge. It takes courage to claim your divinity. It takes courage to buck the system that is currently in place. The practice of always looking outside of yourself for the answers it is my prayer that you will tune into your own vast storehouse of knowledge and allow that wisdom to come forth. You see, you're already connected. You are intimately connected to every light being that comes to your awareness. There is no need for feeling less than. There is only a need for taking time each day to be quiet and to allow that wisdom to burst forth. Now we're gonna hear from the female perspective, Sishat. She was known as the fairy godmother of Egypt, by the way, and they had many lifetimes together. Here's what she says. It gives me great joy to be joining with Toth in this transmission. Yes, it was Toth who wrote the Emerald Tablets over 36,000 years ago. Yet it was I, Sishat, who gave him the strength and support needed to keep returning again and again to be your teacher. In the days of Atlantis, I was known as Elnor, leader of the Atlantean warrior women of light. 
in the Egyptian lifetimes that Toth and I shared together, I became known as Sishat. We partnered to do many wonderful things for the people of those times. So here's what I ask her. Well, why didn't Toth write about you and the original tablets? And here's what she said. Well, he did. I am known as the Lady of Light, Tablet 10, verses 21 to 27. You can find this book divided into chapter and verse so you can study it very easily, especially with the group. This account tells a story of how I was taken prisoner by the dark lords of Arulu. It was Toth who came to my defense and rescued me from the Dark Lords. Such a daring feat demanded an extraordinarily powerful ceremony. Toth donned robes of purple and gold. He then beat a secret rhythm on a drum made of serpent skin. Upon his head was a crown of silver as he spoke the sacred words that the dark lords could not disobey. Preparation for such a fearless rescue required Toth to pass time and time again through purification fires. He fasted from both food and water for days in order to gain sufficient spiritual power to be able to prevail against the dark lords of Arulu. These evil entities had to step aside and release me. So fierce was the power and authority of Toth. It is my honor to take part in this next step forward in getting the timeless wisdom of the Emerald Tablets out to the world. In reading Emerald Tablet 3, this one, you will experience an awakening within your DNA and cellular structure. Even when the words do not make sense to your rational mind, your spirit mind is dancing with glee. It is recommended to focus time and again on Tablet 3, the key of wisdom, this one for it is most relevant to modern life. Gaining knowledge of Tablet 3 opens the doors of understanding to all of the writings of Toth the Atlantean. Indeed, Tablet 3 is the key to all. And now, stay tuned as I guide you in a healing ceremony. Ask by Toth and Seashat. One moment. You will find this a very simple ceremony. I may be given others for other chapters. You see this, this is a raw ruby and it's from India. Now ruby indicates healing of the heart. And in this book, It talks time and time again about listening to your heart. Pay attention to your heart's desires. So I was, I asked Toth and Sishat, well, do you want to do a little ceremony with the readers? Do you want to infuse this book with power? And they said, yes. So I actually used this as a dowsing instrument to put healing energy into this book. And especially, you see this key? In a moment, I'm gonna ask you to touch this key. So just know that it's infused with healing energy. When you buy this book, every book will have the same healing energy. So what I want to do now, it's a very simple ceremony, but it's important that you just let go of your resistance to getting any good from this, okay? Because you know the old mind says, oh, it's so stupid. I say, 
I listen to Tothan C. Shat. So follow my finger. Your eyeballs are gonna help you clear, okay? Follow my finger just with your eyeballs around and around and just think about letting go, letting go. Woo, I'm making myself dizzy here. Let go of all your resistance to receiving healing. Now, touch the key with your hand. Just touch it and think about something wonderful happening for you in your mind, body, spirit. Think about something wonderful happening to your loved ones. Think about wonderful things happening in the earth. This is the powerful vibration that you're setting up to benefit not only yourself, but so many others. And that is the ceremony. Now, if you liked this little bit, you'll love the whole book. It's only $14.95. You can get it on Amazon, soon to be in other bookstores. I'll have the link below to purchase it. If you have questions for Toth and C-Shat, put them in the comment section below and I'll be back very soon with another chapter from my, I think it's amazing. I love it, I love it, I love it. It was so easy to channel this in. The secret key to the Emerald Tablets of Toth the Atlantean with his divine counterpart, Rebecca Marina Messenger. God bless. Share this video if you feel it's been helpful. And I'll be back real soon.